some runner-ups in the state last year. How, how hungry is this group coming into the season? Uh, we real hungry. We talk about this every day, when it's state. That's our main goal. Every day, every day, every day we talk about this. Who do you see as your biggest challenge on the state of Indiana? Uh, in the state of Indiana? In our area, it's, it's west side. West side. It's west side. Coach, one by big march tonight, obviously not a team that's on your same talent level. What, what do you want the boys to work on when you're when you're in a blowout like that? Uh, we want to constantly keep working on uh, our weaknesses, executing, knowing where to go, getting other guys who don't have that much experience, playing time, and uh, familiarizing them what they're going to need to do when you, uh, you still are learning the experience. You just don't want to uh, be up and down and don't have any structure. So for the most part, I'll give it about a C plus, you know, keeping the structure and doing the blowout. Well, you obviously have some talent, you know, even in that second team, those younger guys. How competitive is practice every day? Oh, it's real deep. A lot of times, the, the non-basketball people don't really don't know the game, don't realize how talented they guys are, and how hard they're working, working on their skill set and being fundamentally sound. We play at a fast pace, but we play fundamental. And we call it uh, hyperball, Coach Thomas, you know what I mean? Going at it hardcore, going at it fast, but being under control at all times. This team, obviously, sec second place in state last year, so probably a lot of hunger. Is, is this something the coaching staff motivates them to say, you know, go out and try and be perfect every night because we want to be the best in the state? Well, don't doubt. We're going to take it one game at a time. We came out preseason ranked number two in the state. I don't know how we ended up number three in the area, but go figure. Uh, but uh, they brung uh, – Indiana, Washington, number one, because they won state, and we're number two. And we already got the game scheduled at Caseco Field House in March. We'll be there. I told the guys, one game at a time. That's all. Nice game out there. You're able to throw down a couple dunks. Is that yeah. something that's fun for you to get out and transition? Uh, like yeah, that? it is. You know, that's what you know. Get the you know our offense running. You know, we're a running team. You know, our dunks. You know, from our uh, kid, you know, Aaron Abram. You know, he's a monster, ferocious dunker. So you know, that's what get us you know hype. You know, get us going. You guys obviously have talent all over the floor. Is, is, is this something that you, you feel like you can come out and dominate most teams every night? Uh, yes, sir. You know, when we lost, you know, state championship, you know, second place, you know, we just told ourselves we're just going to be dedicated and work hard. So, you know, and, uh, doing the drills, you know, in practice, you know, we guys just work hard, working on everything. So that, that's good for us. Is that something as, as a senior you're extra hungry for to go out on top? Uh, you know, I'm ready hungry. You know, I'm just trying to, you know, working on getting Mr. Basketball. Uh, you know, I got to, you know, top, you know, compete, competitor, uh, Cody Zella and Marcus T. So, you know, I know those guys are going to work hard. So, you know, I'm going to just keep, you know, playing, working hard and being dedicated. Is it fun for you to compete against guys? Uh, obviously, he's not in your same position, but it, with, with Anthony Davis? Uh, yes, Anthony Davis is a good kid. You know, before I came in here, you know, we was getting taped. You know, he told me, you know, he be coming for us. So, you know, he was just talking a little trash. So, you know, I told him I'm going to see him on the next level, you know. Speaking of that, Michigan State, uh, did you get to see any of the Spartans last night? You, 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 you kind of gave them a run. Yeah, I did see them lose. You know, it was you know a tough loss. You know, I thought that you know they could have played a little bit harder, could have worked that a little bit, but you know I know Coach Izzo is going to get those guys ready. How do you see yourself fitting in there on the next level? Are you excited about that? Very excited. I see myself fitting, you know, a two guard, three guard, working on my left hand, my ball handling. You know, I see myself, you know, Coach Izzo love guys that hit the glass. So you know, I think that you know I can just come in and be a you know. Gary basketball playing, you know, hit the glass, you know, be, you know, work hard. Well, maybe you and Anthony will see each other in the Final Four next year. Uh, you know, hopefully, hopefully, hopefully.